I get to take over today. <laughs> Yesterday we did all camp stuff. We ran up mountains. We worked out. Uh, we shot bows, and now we get to go to the range. So I'm comfortable. So <laughs> she's calling the shots today. Yesterday, I guess we did sort of what I do. Today, sort of. <laughs> today it's your world. Yeah. So we got we got so much so many guns. Oh yeah, I might have forgotten makeup and other womanly essentials, but I showed up with cases of guns and ammo and gear. I'm mostly excited about the gear. We're gonna get you set up with all sorts of awesome stuff. I can't wait. It's so, gonna be cool. So normally, like I'm feeling the pressure. I got a guest here. And, I got to come up with all the entertaining type stuff today. Let me entertain I'm off. you. I'm off. <laughs> now we're just going to go shoot stuff. Absolutely. It'll all be right. good. It'll let's, be good. Let's do it. We got Cam a macro comp with the Romeo X, so he does have an option on this one. Fantastic. This will be his carry gun option. And then this will be his big gun option. This will be his main pistol for tomorrow, the DH-3320. This, this will be quick as soon as you're done. Yes. Nice. And then we have our face plates. Okay, awesome. I got our three pieces that we yep. need. Okay, cool. Yep. You mind if we use your wheelbarrow? Not Go for it. And we should have load it up. Our <laughs> so we're gonna give each of them three steel targets because steel targets are fun. We're also going to put up some paper targets, bump it a bum. This is a USPSA style paper target. This is what I compete on mostly. Three different scoring rings. We'll talk about that later, but yeah. Steel is the most fun to shoot. Your holster, okay. and this is called a drop, mm -hmm. so that it lowers it from your belt level, mm -hmm. makes it more comfortable. Okay. And then you have your thigh strap that you'll need to adjust down to be a little bit secure around okay. it. Dun, 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 dun. But the joy of this little strap around your leg is that you don't have to have another belt on the inside and belt loops to keep your belt down. Because mm -hmm. we're going to be drawing our gun up. So yeah, if there's nothing it. there, you'll literally pull it up to, mm -hmm. to your armpits. Oh. We're not gonna work out of holsters for a minute. We're gonna go through shooting and everything <clears throat> first because holstering and unholstering our gun is one of the most dangerous steps right. um, in shooting. So we're gonna get super comfortable with our guns and gear first and then come back to our belts that are now set up mm -hmm. and a bit more ready for us. We're gonna do a little bit of what's called dry fire where we're gonna go through all the motions of shooting but without ammo. Okay. Um, and then we'll move down to our table. We'll do some live fire once we're comfy and cozy there. Then we can like start to implement a little bit more of the gear. By the end of the day, my goal is to have y'all drawing out of um, these outside the waistband holsters. Mm -hmm. We're always fighting recoil in shooting. And our connection to the earth is one of the best and easiest ways to mitigate that. So any type of athletic stance is appropriate. I personally am a little bit wider than shoulders stance and my toes are always at least heel to toe or further forward so I need a good wide stance in depth and in width most importantly is where our weight is in our feet so recoil pistol rifle shotgun doesn't matter it's always just gonna be a motion directly back and up every time you pull the trigger guys off back and up sometimes a lot of back and a lot of up sometimes a little back and a lot up. but that's all we're trying to counteract. So our stance is there to counteract the back and recoil. So no matter how my feet actually end up looking, what's most important is that my weight is in the balls of my feet and that my toes are actively engaging the ground. So where do we They're open strong, jars? Right? Yeah, where do we open jars and thread right needles? Close. Close. Right in here, our mm -hmm. place of strength and dexterity. 
Most instructors will teach you to lock your elbows. The reason that they do that is because it's a universal answer. It's very easy to tell everybody. Mm. Lock your arms, everybody got it. Right. Can't do it wrong. But you have no strength and no dexterity left in your hands. So we're gonna wanna bring our gun slightly back. My elbows are here. They're slightly bent so that I can activate more muscles for the same job. My arms are also locked. The only thing that's holding on to that gun are my mighty forearms. So as soon as you hear that, the buzz the beep. All right, shoot is ready. Stay on by. Stay on by. one shot. Woo, take it. So great. Let's unload our guns. So take your mag out. Also wrap the round out of the chamber. Nice. How are you doing? Are you John Wick? Huh? Are you John Wick? <laughs> yeah. Oh, jeez. Yeah. <laughs> Cam, very excellent. We see it's just a smidgen to the left. It could be that your gun's off you know, that much. I didn't super, I th I super check them. I think it's left because I was, I was holding a little to the right and it's still hitting. Okay, okay, well then we can adjust that and make okay. sure we bring it over. Super nice core. This was your last shot when I told you to push. Mm -hmm. This was a 310 first shot. Mm. Anyways, nicely done. I think we're doing excellent. Now we take our pasters here. Uh -huh. We can see that we have our control and our, yeah. and our um, consistency. Yeah. But now it's like, do it faster. Because with, with archery, I take, I take time to make sure I'm oh, ready. Yeah. So it's like always precision. So it's hard to yeah. switch. Oh, just wait. We're right now. Our first mag was just one shots to establish that we know sight picture grip. Yeah. We're repeating our technique a few times. Now we're gonna start to add on more and more shots. Stand by. Huh? It's this far outside your alpha. Okay. Your, your hits literally went right where all your other hits were, and you have one right here. We are still totally in control. Mm -hmm. Very nice. Three and a half seconds, both shots. Beautiful. First shot was a 235. <laughs> Sounds 
like for six and one, I'll do two, two, and two. Shoes ready. Yep. Stand by. Two, two, and two. Should sound the same because our gun motion shouldn't actually add any time at this small of a distance. Nobody wants 